Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Fallout 76. My name is Camel, and today I'm going to show you where to find the Civil War era suit and the Civil War era top hat. Now, there may be other locations in which we can find these items, but at the moment, this is the only place that I know of where we can find them. And if you are into this kind of stuff, links to my other Fallout 76 videos can be found down in the description, along with links to my social media. Be sure to check all of that out after this video, and after you get this cool Civil War set. Now, getting these items is quite simple. It just takes a bit of looking. That's all. Well, for me, it took some looking. For you, it's going to be a cinch. We'll need to come to the ancient town of Helvetia, founded by Swiss and German settlers long ago. It can be found right here, where I am standing at the moment, and lies southeast of Vault 76. This town will probably be swarming with Scorched, so come prepared for that. But once we get to this beautiful town, what we want to look for is this small wooden shack. Without markings, without signs, or a letterbox, or any sign of anything cool being inside, that's the trick. It's sitting innocently at the edge of the town against the wooded backdrop and wilderness beyond. And if you do have trouble finding it, it's to the east of the church, but I'm sure you'll have no issue. Now once we do find it, we want to head on inside. At the back of the room, there is a shattered display case with both the Civil War era suit and the Civil War era top hat within it. And if you so desire, there is a second Civil War era top hat on the ground to the left as well grab it all. So now we have it, let's take a look at it. It's a really nice set overall. I like it a lot. The top hat is the standard top hat, just as you'd expect. Now the suit is comprised of a dirty white dress shirt, a black bow tie, a dirty tan vest, and the long battered navy jacket over the top. We also have some dark greyish brown pants and a pair of really cool knee-high black leather boots. So not only is this outfit fashionable and stylish, but ready for action too. So we get the cool top hat, which if there was a list of best looking hats, I reckon this would be at the top. And the suit looks like you're about to come over the hill with a blunderbuss and delete your enemy from existence with a black powder powered miniature cannonball. So aesthetically, it definitely fits many builds, characters, and play styles, and in general, it's just a nice default set for players. If you're not sure what you want to tell people around the wasteland, eh, come get this, slap it on. You look semi-dangerous, semi-important, cool, fashionable, it kind of ticks all the boxes. So be sure to come and grab it immediately. In fact, it's so cool if you do run into other players who are looking for it and you have to fight them for it, ironically, it might just kick off a civil war. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen, I've been Camel, and this has been my guide for the Civil War era suit and the Civil War era top hat. I do hope this video helped you out, and if it did, you will be very interested in checking out my other Fallout 76 videos that I've already done. Links to them can be found down in the description. Now down there, in the old description, you can find links to my social media, be sure to follow me on Twitter and Instagram, and if you would like to support the channel, be sure to subscribe, or if you'd like to support the channel in a more personal way, you can become a patron on Patreon or a sponsor of the channel right here on YouTube. As I'm sure you know, all of my time and energy goes into making these videos that I create for you to enjoy, so your support is most genuinely appreciated and welcomed in any and all forms. So thank you very much for watching, thank you for supporting the channel, and I will see you very shortly in the next video. I'll see you there soon.